Hi, Alan. Really good session today. Good to see you in the golf ball as well as you were at the end. As we discussed, the golf swing is all about angles, making sure we swing the club on the correct angle to make it come back down to the golf ball and get the strike we're looking for. You can see here on the left-hand side of the club going back very, very low beneath that green line, which is called the shaft plane, simply because the shaft is on that line of setup. The club now going very much underneath that position. Weight tend to go back on the sort of right heel there. As you come into the golf ball now, the angle is just not conducive. Your force to sort of drop yourself into the golf ball, as we can see, to try and get down. Because obviously the tendency is from this position now to top the golf ball. You can see you still drop a, the golf ball, but just not enough. And we catch top of the golf ball, and the ball then runs down the range along the ground. What we're looking for is to swing that club and the hands and arms up this green line. And what you'll see now, I'm sure you'll be pleased to see, as this club goes back, the hands and arms working up that green line, lovely. Nice position there, sort of halfway back with the hands on the green line. Shaft angle now much better, much more conducive to going up, which as we said, what goes up can now come down. So a better angle going back, the hands now work back down that green line. Lovely strike as we can see impact, and then right the way through to a full finish as the ball was flying straighter and further down the range. So just work on that angle. Just make sure that shaft and the wrist hinge up. Get that club going up in the backswing, Alan. And the club then can come down, making a good strike, getting a lot more height and a lot more distance. So hope that helps. Any questions, obviously, give me a shout, and I'll see you soon.